Hello, now that we know the basic methods of modeling, today we will get acquainted with the most popular program for creating 3D models, games and animations, Autodesk 3ds Max. As you know, this is a professional program for three-dimensional computer graphics used to create models, animations, games and images. Software is used in almost all industries to design and manufacture products, as well as to create visual effects, interactive games and educational models, and in the arts. With the help of the program, 3D artists and developers create video games, advertising and visualization. We also use 3D Studio Max in our work on the digitization of cultural artifacts as part of the implementation of the project employment and tourism through the use of new technologies. After the end of this video course, part of the e-tour. Net video guide, each of you will be able to use the program and create graphic models yourself. Before we learn how to work with software. However, let's learn a little more about its features. Some of the main features of 3ds Max are the ability to dynamically simulate, create and display maps and sketches, variable user interface and support for your own scripting language. The most important function of the program, as the name suggests, is the possibility of three-dimensional modeling. Users can see rendering results without actually rendering the scene, and with the help of a feature called reverse kinematics, the user can create animated models and develop scenes with multiple objects and different components. 3D Studio Max has animation controllers that can be created, modified and even shared. 3D Studio Max is the preferred software in the architectural industry, where architects and interior designers use the program to create 3D models of interior and exterior architecture to better understand the building or site. Some architects use AutoCAD for their architectural drawings, where 2D predominates. That's why Autodesk 3ds Max has a feature for importing and processing 2D drawings. With 3D Max, the user can create, texture, display and illuminate objects and see the desired results. Autodesk 3ds Max is not the only 3D modeling software. Some users use the Maya program, but it is more suitable for filming and animation. In addition, according to experts, 3ds Max has a better user interface. It offers some tools and modifiers that are very simple and make the task easier. The advantages of 3ds Max include compatibility with other Autodesk products, such as AutoCAD, Autodesk Revit and Autodesk Inventor. 3ds Max is time-saving software thanks to a wide range of additional tools for modeling, animation and mapping. The 3ds Max interface is intuitive and easy to use. Workspaces, tools, commands and the interface are quite seamless. Modeling, texturing and rendering objects, as well as animation, are supported by a wide range of tools and features that make work easier. Autodesk supports the so-called library of materials for its products. It is a repository for features and effects, some of which are pre-installed with the program, but others should be further downloaded. 3ds Max has many built-in activated and external software components, the so-called plugins that can be added to our 3D concepts. Each plugin has its significance for improving the creation process and, accordingly, the quality of the end result. In case you are interested, in our website, eTour.net you will find additional information about some interesting plugins and their use. Working with 3ds Max is not an easy task for beginners, but with desire, perseverance and practice, the application can be learned by anyone interested in 3D modeling and infrastructure. Users who have knowledge of working with 3D software will have an advantage. But getting acquainted with the program will not take long for beginners. It is important to know, that due to the high cost of the commercial version of the program, Autodesk offers a free student version, which strictly mentions that it should be used only for educational purposes. The student version has almost the same features as the full version, but is for single use only and cannot be installed on a network. This student license expires three years after purchase. To get started with 3ds Max, of course, you must first install the program on your computer. More details, as well as minimum technical requirements for the device for work, you will find in the training materials on our website, eTourNet.eu. Once we have the software installed, we should get acquainted with the interface, basic tools and functionalities of 3ds Max. We are waiting for you in the next lessons, part of the eTourNet video guide.